When my skin is dead Or my sickness fills the air In my silent final prayer My heart is yours if your body creeps My vows aren't very long but they're sincere. I first promise to always touch your butt and then smack it when it's appropriate and maybe when it's not. <laughs> promise to help you laugh at the wrong times like now <laughs> about the wrong <laughs> things. <laughs> to protect you and love you and care for you. And I promise to always support you when you struggle because I know that sometimes you do and I want to help you. Enjoy life, enjoy it together. If I could see what I wrote, that'd be nice. <laughs> Pick you up when you fall down, you have a hard time. I'll always help you through what you need to get through. If I could see, that'd be nice. <laughs> uh, I could be. I promise to always fall more in love with you each day, as we always have. That's all I really have. I want you to know I love you so much. And three years was a really short time, but I'm so excited for the rest of our lives to grow and experience more together. I do love you so much, Casey. Caleb, as cliche as this sounds, you came around when I least expected it, but when I most needed it. From our first adventure in Zion Canyon, I knew there was something special about you. And after a short time, I knew my life would never be the same without you. You're the one who knows me best and who embraces all of my quirks. You're my other half, my best friend, and the one who truly makes me a better person. When I'm with you, I'm home. Today, I promise to love you wholeheartedly. I promise to value your feelings and to continue to encourage you to be the best you can be. I promise to be the Leia to your Han. <laughs> Always be your biggest supporter and give you all the cuddles you need, which is quite a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I promise to work through all of the hard times and laugh in all the good times. I'm excited <coughs> to begin our adventure. I love you so much. You too. I love you. Clark Baldwin and Casey Lynn Coons. You have taken one another by the right hand in token of the covenants you will now enter into in the presence of God and these witnesses. Caleb Clark Baldwin, do you take Casey Lynn Coons as your lawfully wedded wife and do you of your own free will and choice covenant as her companion and lawfully wedded husband, that you will cleave unto her and none else, that you will observe all the laws, covenants, and obligations pertaining to the holy state of matrimony, and that you will love, honor, and cherish her as long as you both shall live. Casey Lynn Coons. Do you take Caleb Clark Baldwin? as your lawfully wedded husband, and do you of your own free will and choice covenant as his companion and lawfully wedded wife that you will cleave unto him and none else, that you will observe all the laws, covenants, and obligations pertaining to the holy state of matrimony, and that you will love, honor, and cherish him as long as you both shall live. I do. Caleb Clark Baldwin and Casey Lynn Coons. <coughs> By virtue of the legal authority vested in me as an elder of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, I pronounce you, Caleb Clark Baldwin and Casey Lynn Coons, husband and wife, legally and lawfully wedded for the period of your mortal lives. May God bless your union with joy in your posterity and a long life of happiness together. 
and may he enable you to keep sacred the covenants you have made. These blessings I invoke upon you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. You're welcome to kiss each other as husband and wife. I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Baldwin. Show me worlds I never 